When creating your first video project, you can choose to start from scratch or get a hand with one of our template designs. Let's begin with a clean canvas. Inside the editor, you'll find your workspace and all your editing tools surrounding it. If you have a voiceover, you can upload it to your video. Just go to the left toolbar and click on the sound menu. And if you have an audio track, you can upload that too. You can also insert an image file of your storyboard by going to the images menu. Here, you can select other images and objects from your desktop to upload. Just drag and drop to insert them into the workspace. If you need an extra object or to edit your background, you can choose the right style from our many graphic libraries, or simply find it with the built-in Google image search. You'll notice that each time you add an object to your workspace, a thumbnail icon of each image appears in the Scenes Overview, and also below in the Editor Timeline. Videos in Video are composed by scenes. Once objects are inserted into a scene, they will automatically appear at the start of the timeline. You can make them appear later in a scene by adjusting them in the timeline. Move the cursor for a live preview. To change the scene you're editing in the workspace, select another from the overview panel. When you select an object, you bring up the toolbox. You can use this to change color, align, rearrange, flip, or rotate an object. To resize, just click and drag the corner handle. The smart guides will help you accurately place and measure your objects. You can also edit your images using a built-in photo editor. It's a huge time saver that lets you conveniently crop or add fun touches to images without leaving the workspace. Find all your videos by navigating to the menu and going to the My Videos page. Now that you're familiar with how to create your first video in the editor, join us in the next video to learn the basics of animation.